So hello, my name is Sean Roberts. Um, I am the Chief Technologist for Lincoln Network, and this is Lincoln Shorts. I have with me Tennessee Secretary of State uh, Hargett. Was there anything uh, Tennessee specific that I didn't cover that you wanted to um, follow up on? Um, no, you know, I, I, I guess the thing I would say, and, and I, I've referenced this earlier, is that election officials across the country, I, I think, are doing their best in a difficult environment. And, and during this pandemic, our focus has really been knowing that most Tennesseans were still going to want to vote in person. And, and so we have worked hard to try and increase the number of early voting sites as well as ours to try and achieve social distancing. You know, we've seen some what happens whenever um, states or cities try to decrease the number of precincts, which puts further pressure on that precinct. And then when, you know, to your point earlier, when people were talking about ballots, not people get concerned about ballots not getting back in or they're not getting their ballots. Then all of a sudden, these people you weren't planning on, they, they come to the polls and those things create long lines. So our goal has been to increase hours, have ample number of spaces and try and keep every single precinct that was open two years ago uh, to be open again. Um, and so that, that's why we're going to have about 1800 precincts open on Election Day. Good Lord willing. And, um, and, and that's why we didn't have problems in August is because of the great preparations we made. And, and many other states are, are doing similar things, just trying to meet the needs of their citizens and meet them where they are. So that's that's essentially your um, uh, you're planning ahead to avoid the possibility of con um, uh, uh, polling place uh, congestion by uh, increasing the number of sites, but also increasing the number of days. Yeah. So, I mean. You know, really increasing early voting sites, increasing number of hours. So, you know, we got a lot of small counties that in the past, they've had one early voting site, and that's their local election commission. And, and, and we raised the possibility to them, well, gosh, what if your election commission, if you had somebody test positive and you had to close the election commission down, you got to have an alternative site. And we also have pushed people to have other satellites beyond the one that they have so that uh, we can increase the ability to social distance and spread out the voters over multiple sites and more, and, and more hours. So these are essentially voting centers um, that, that, that the term well, where anybody from yeah. the can vote at that spot, at that location. So essentially, that's how our early voting system works. Um, you know, in the early voting system, in each county, you don't have to vote at one particular site. You know, you can go to any one of the early voting centers. Now, we do have a handful of counties that are using voting centers instead of assigned precincts. Uh, you know, we had one, one county did it, I believe back in 16, um, went, actually 18, went well for them. And now we've had three other counties who are, who are doing it in 2020 and trying it out. And, um, and, and voters seem to enjoy that. Okay, uh, but uh, day of election, that's still polling places or it's- uh, Yeah, with the, with, the, with the exception of those four counties that I mentioned. Understood. So those four, those four counties, they'll have voting centers. The other 91 counties, you'll have your home precinct that you go vote at. Right, and they're still, I assume, using uh, paper voter rolls as well. Well, they may be using, um, you know, some will be using that, some will be um, using electronic poll books. Oh, so you have a, you have a mix there too. Excellent, okay. Um, well, I think that was, uh, we covered about everything we could possibly cover. That was very thorough. Thank you for being so generous with your time, sir. Thank you for joining us. This has been Lincoln Shorts.